be me, DM of crazy magic campaign, be not me, changeling rogue, human fighter, human wizard, and lizard folk ranger fighter. The party is traveling north, trying to fight the orc lizard folk Nazi alliance, lead by Gruumsh god of war and hate himself. The fuck.jpg, party is level 11, and just got really good legendary magic items from an artificer they befriended. The rogue got a special, self-replenishing vial of poison that does psychic damage and forces creatures to lie. The fighter got a magic headband of heavenly radiance. The wizard got a special tome that lets him learn extra spells, basically magical secrets on steroids, and the ranger got an armor set that made him harder to kill, negate one fatal attack per long rest, advantage on death saves, 15 or above counts as a 20. I thought it might let them win a fight against the god of war himself, they were supposed to fight him like, 5 levels later, fighter cannot make it to the session, so I decide to just DMPC him if there's a fight. Party moves out, hoping to reach the north in 4 days. First 2 days pass by uneventfully, with the exception of a botched arrow shot landing in the draft horse's ass. The party is taking watch. Rangers shift, rolls a natural 20. Sees distant campfires up north, asks to roll to figure out their number. Tell them to roll survival. Rolls decent. Tell them the minimum number is 50, while the maximum is 200. They'll probably intercept you by 2pm tomorrow. Well fuck. Next morning, party considers their options. After much consideration, they decide to set a bunch of traps and wait. My face when the rogue literally can't roll lower than a 19 on every trap check. Reliable talent can bite me. Wizard asks me if he can figure out when the orc lizard Nazis will arrive. Flat intelligence check. Rolls 14 tells him it'd take about 8 hours. Decided to help the rogue. Party sets 24 pit traps, 1 paralysis poison trap, and 1 bull bearings trap. The army arrives a little past 6 and a half hours. Wizard freaks out, everyone rolls stealth, rogue rolls insanely well, as does the ranger. Wizard rolls a 16, orc's passive perception is 16, there is a cracking noise, and a ballista flies right towards the wizard, who barely avoids the attack. Rogue sees an orc with a single glowing eye. An orc possessed by Gruumsh himself, rogue fire a crossbow bolt, hits. Activates his assassin crit feature. Gruumsh immediately falls, the bolt flying straight through his skull. Another orc's eye begins to glow. Ranger fires off a single arrow into the horde, which immediately transforms into a mess of spiky vines. Spike growth is a bitch. Tells the party to roll for initiative. My plan, have them get shit wrecked by the horde of enemies, run away, and fight some elite strong orcs. Ranger goes first. Sends all of his attacks towards Gruumsh, using his action surge to kill him. Another orc gets possessed. Rogue fires another bolt. Kills another orc immediately. Bonus action hide. Wizard looked for the ballista. Fireballs it and everyone nearby. Orcs turns. 26 of them get insta killed by the pit traps of Ollie of massive arrows fall from the sky, hurting everyone except the rogue. Orcs and lizard folk are being torn to shreds by the spikes. Gruumsh taunts the ranger. They have some history together. Ranger fires off more arrows, killing another of Gruumsh's vessels. Rogue shoots more bolts, hides. Wizard teleports away as orcs draw closer. Another volley of arrows hits everyone but the rogue. The melee troops draw closer. Gruumsh begins moving into combat range. A small group of lizard folk move in to fight the ranger. One calls him a traitor for abandoning them. Each moves to attack. Hit, miss, crit. One of the ranger's lungs are pierced by the lizard folk's spears. The ranger has been very reluctant and mournful when confronted by the deaths of his fellow lizard folk, but he is resolved to survive. His longbow transforms into two magic short swords. He breaks off the spear with his elbow and slashes deep into one of the lizard folk's chest, and drives the other short sword into his skull. Ranger mutters a small prayer, hoping his fallen brother finds peace. The fight rages on. Orcs and lizard folk dying left and right. Rogue uses a magic item to cast hypnotic pattern, stopping about 20 orcs in their tracks the wizard, afraid of getting hit, 
spends two turns running the fuck away. Eventually, Grumsh walks up to the ranger. The ranger's closest, if not only, friend is an orc who ran away from Grumsh, and whose only wish is to know a life free from his influence. When the ranger met an orc Grumsh was possessing, he challenged him for the soul of his friend. He lost in one turn, three of Grumsh's mighty punches sending him flying, unconscious, out the tent. Grumsh has also basically indoctrinated the last of the lizard folk into his cult of personality, and desires to kill all humans and elves and subjugate all else. Grumsh moves in, his punch is now weakened from the fact he's possessing a weaker orc. Still, they hit hard, and the ranger is wounded. Rogue moves in and fucking stabs him for 30 plus damage, instantly killing the vessel. Sneak attack bitch.jpg. The wizard starts moving closer to the party, attempting to do bits of damage and healing party members. Orcs continue the fall, but Grumsh possesses one after another, his resolve to force the ranger into submission growing with each dead orc. Rogue just keeps murdering his ass. A volley of massive arrows is about to knock the ranger out, but his armor forms a protective barrier, stopping them. Still gets beat to shit by Grumsh, burns through a ton of healing. MFW when I remember the fighter exists. Decide he's been fucking murdering orcs left and right in the middle of the horde, comes over to help the party. Wizard says fuck it, uses polymorph to turn the ranger into a T-Rex. Grumsh starts swinging at the wizard, but somehow he keeps concentration up. Rogue continues murdering him. Ranger tries to bite, misses, then sends a random orc flying into a death pit with his tail. Think they've killed like 70 orcs or something at this point. Eventually wizard gets knocked out, polymorph drops, and the bad starts happening fast. Grumsh turns his attention back to the ranger, starts beating his ass. Ranger's player begins considering what their new character is gonna be. Ranger drops to 0 HP, and instantly fails 2 death saves because of one last attack. It's his turn, rolls a 7 on death save. Oh no. Wizard's player remembers he has advantage. Rolls again. 17. Ranger hears a thousand voices calling to him, asking him to stand up and survive. Ranger opens his eyes, gets up, and slashes Gruumsh's vessel to death. Gruumsh keeps taunting, saying how it's too bad someone with so much spirit is a damned idiot. Rogue murders. Fighter murder. Wizard succeeds on death saves. Arrows start flying towards the wizard, hits. Fails one death save. Ranger keeps slashing wildly in his anger. Rogue rogues it up. Fighter fights. Wizard succeeds death save. More arrows. Another failed save. Grumsh punches the ranger hard, knocking him out again and instantly forcing him to fail two death saves. Ranger succeeds at death save, but does not wake up. Later, orcs turn again. Fire more arrows. Two of the wizard. Wizard's armor class is 13. Roll 2. 8 and 11 total. Remember they are at disadvantage because prone. Roll again. 11 and a 17. Wizard survives another turn. Player calls bullshit, so I send him screenshots. The fighter activates his magic weapon, casting call lightning, instantly obliterating some of the orcs. Ranger wakes up. Grumsh looks surprised, pissed. Ranger kills him again. Rogue is throwing daggers and stabbing shit left and right. Fighter tries to resuscitate wizard to no avail. Grumsh charges in, yelling to the ranger about why he won't die. Attacks become wilder, Rogue gets an opportunity slash. Orcs support with more arrows, some come in with long swords. It's a whirlwind of blades and magic, lightning and bolts. All the lizard folk are dead, and orc after orc keeps falling. Grumsh just keeps attack always stealing another body when the one he's wearing dies. By this point, there was just about 6 to 10 orcs still fighting, while the rest are still charmed by the pattern, which only has about 2 to 4 rounds left. Party steps it into overdrive, trying to kill the last of the active orcs. Everyone is pretty bloody. After taking out 3, the rogue decides it'd be best to run the fuck away. He grabs the wizard, tells the fighter to grab the ranger and gets onto the wagon they traveled on. Fighter grabs Ranger, hops down behind the horses, and calls down more lightning, scorching more orcs. Rogue shoots the last active one, 
Fighter starts driving as the pattern disappears, and Gruumsh comes charging at them. Ranger wakes up, and he uses cure wounds to wake up the wizard, then starts firing arrows. Wizard looked out onto the last remnants of the army, and a fireball consumed them all in an instant. The fight was finally over. The party found a place to sleep safely, and took a long rest. When they woke they saw an orc they had never seen before, tall, muscular, missing one eye, and smiling like a monster. Each orc lizard folk had roughly 20 hit points. The party wiped out about a 150 of them, which roughly equates to about 3000 points of damage over the course of 13 rounds. I was so shocked, proud, and mildly pissed, that I decided it was worth 2 levels. My face when I realize I've created monsters.